hey guys so welcome to the free training on institutional trading concepts now this particular video training will show you how to trade institutional trading concept how to trade with a large institution okay it is about it is less than one hour long okay ensure that you go through everything in this video because it is going to change the game for you if you are really really serious about becoming consistently profitable in your first day career you need to watch this particular content okay also within this video you learn exactly how to access two thousand us dollars instant funding for free okay uh, this is money that you can use to trade on your live account and then you keep the profit all right so i'll see you inside let me get straight into my computer right now hey guys welcome to this short training on institutional trading concept and guys my goal today is to expose you to this trading concept that can make you a multi-millionaire in the foreign exchange market right you don't have to keep blowing your accounts now you can start you can start trading with confidence and making profits a lot more consistently all right so i'm going to review to you exactly why you have been losing money in the forex market okay i'm going to tell you exactly what you need to start doing what you need to start looking for in the market the footprint you should start looking out for in the market okay and then to get more information about everything and how to get started i'm going to give you an offer at the end of this particular training for people that want to learn more okay if you want to learn more and get to work with me i'll give you an offer and then i'll show you testimonials of people that are making money currently all right so let's get down to business guys now i have about 30 minutes to to do this so i'm going to try my best to give you the major concepts major points that will start i'll help you to become profitable okay now i want to start from the concepts of the market okay now when you are trading institutionally you have to have um, a good understanding of the market of, of economics so let's give an example now. So let's say you go to your normal market in your area. Okay. There are two kinds of people in the market, people that are there to buy stuff and then people that are there to sell stuff. Now those two activities go hand in hand, buying and selling those hand in hand. Okay. For you to buy a particular commodity in the market, there has to be somebody ready to sell to you. Okay. For um, for a seller in that particular market to sell something, for that selling action to take place, there has to be somebody willing to buy. Okay, so if you are buying, there has to be someone ready to sell. If somebody is selling, there, there has to be somebody ready to buy. Likewise, in the foreign exchange markets, the commodity that we have in the market is the currency. Okay, we are in the currency market. Now, most of you log on to your mt4 and then you just click on buy you click on sell okay think to yourself when you buy euro usd for example who exactly are you buying from at that particular price when you sell euro usd who exactly is buying from you okay so and then once you understand that concept that will give you an analogy of how trading institutionally works and why a lot of retail traders lose money in the market okay so for example let's do this quickly because of our time okay so um an average retail trader buys at support right you are told to buy at support so you buy at a support area okay and what do you do you put your stop loss somewhere around here below support right now you know that the market participants the government the big banks you know they are the ones that, that can actually move a currency they are the ones that can actually move price in a particular direction retail traders we are on the lower end of the stick we don't have the volume needed to move anything all right so if the currency pay is buying it is the work of the big institutions that have the volume remember the forex market is averaging about six to 
to several trillion dollars on a daily basis. Okay, and retail traders account for less than ten percent of that volume, far less than ten percent of that volume. Now, if for the big bank institutions to buy Euro USD, for them to push this market up, for them to push it up, okay, they are buying. Think about yourself: who are they going to buy from? Okay, who are they going to buy from? There has to be people willing to sell that particular currency. And us as retail traders, we put our stop loss here. Okay? Now, your stop loss are orders. They are pending orders. Okay? They are sell orders for this particular scenario. So, what they do in order to move the market up is that they need to amass volume in the market. Okay, so that is why they push the market all the way down. They take out your liquidity, okay? And that is what they will use to move the market up. It is simple economics, demand and supply, okay? It, it is something that occurs in our day-to-day -day lives, right? So that is why a lot of retailers lose money because they don't understand this concept. This has been happening since the since since we as small traders started trading in the foreign exchange market this has been happening and it will continue happening till eternity likewise if you are selling you are told to sell at resistance right so when price gets to a, a, a resistance zone your goal is to look for sell opportunities right but if you are selling think to yourself who are you buying from okay who is who who are you um who are you selling to who is buying that particular currency from you at that particular price point again retail traders don't have the volume to move the market the people that can move the market are the large institutions the larger market participants all right so before they can move sell a particular currency all right retail traders of course you put your stop loss above resistance okay but before this can happen before they can sell okay there has to be people ready to buy here so a lot of times what they do is move the market up take our liquidity okay they grab our liquidity okay once they amass enough volume okay then the market starts going in the right direction which is why a lot of times when you are trading and then you set your stop loss right you find out that your stop loss gets hit and then almost immediately price starts going in the direction that you originally proposed okay because they have created a market structure that suits what you were taught as a retail trader Pretty much every trader trades the same way. You are trading support and resistance. You are trading trend lines. You are trading reversal patterns. Think to yourself, who taught you these strategies? Okay. If they work so much, why is it that eight out of every 10 traders are still blowing accounts to this day with many educational platforms online, with many videos on YouTube? Why is it that? There is ready, there is information about trading readily available on YouTube, on other platforms, but traders are still losing money because we are trading retail concepts. And then they won't teach you about liquidity graphs. They won't teach you about all of these concepts because this is just normal. Okay. For buying to occur, there has to be selling. For selling to occur, there has to be buying all right so how can you use this particular information now and put it in the mix and start trading institutionally all right so let, let us look uh, a bit about looking into some ways that they grab liquidity and then we'll go into the trading strategy shortly okay now if you're trading support and resistance trend lines heads and shoulders w and m patterns you need to stop okay you need to stop so let me let's see how they manipulate trade here okay for example you see this particular support here this is a support zone right and then you as a retail trader what are your thoughts your thoughts 
to buy here. So when you see this candle, all right, it's giving you, is this called a Pimba or a Rami? I don't know what it's called, or a Doji. And then you, you think that this is a rejection. So you enter a buy here. And then because you are trading resistance, so you would most likely want to exit here or here. And then you put your stop loss just below this um, support here. But check out what happened. Price went your direction, okay, a bit, and then took out your stop loss. And then you saw that sharp move to the upside, okay? You lost the trade, okay? This is liquidity that was being grabbed here. Okay, they grab liquidity. All right, let's find another example. Okay. Now, this, 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 this happens so, so much. Let me find an example for, let's say, the head and shoulder pattern, how it feels, and then um, what it's all about. Okay. I'm not seeing one. Okay, I'm not seeing one. Now, let's look at, look at another example. This is a support zone here. Check it out. This is equal, equal what lows, okay, over here. And then this may also pass as a W pattern, right? Okay, W, right, now. So, check this out. See how liquidity was grabbed here. Price was pushed all the way down here, okay, to grab liquidity here because this is a setup by the market makers they grab your liquidity and for people that don't use stop loss okay there's no way this move will go against you and you'll not be tempted to close your trade okay so they grab liquidity here and then see what happened a sharp move because they've grabbed enough liquidity that's enough volume for them to move price in the direction okay and then price came to that resistance area that you think you want to put your take profit okay now this happens over and over again still on that same zone okay if you are putting if you are saying this is a resistance zone okay if you go to a lower time frame now this is the daily charts over here if you go to a lower time frame okay you will see lots of um fake out here that will make you think that this is about to sell but they grab liquidity all right and then push the market all the way down guys all right liquidity grabs are a thing okay and it is real in the market and it's not that you know that's just the way economics works okay demand and supply for buy to occur there has to be a sell for a sell to occur there has to be a buy so quickly let's go into the checklist how you can start trading institutionally now there are uh we have a seven step checklist okay but in this video i'll not review everything because of time um that that information for our premium subscribers so i'll just tell you three things from that checklist and then if you want to learn more about the other part of the checklist then you take the offer that i'll um, tell you at the end of this training okay so the first thing you want to look at understanding the market is to identify okay let us identify market structure want to identify market structure right you want to step two is you want to identify okay break of structure and then number three is you want to identify supply or demand okay so let me just give you one jara step four okay you want to do your confirmation on lower time frame lower time frame confirmation okay good so this is a four step process okay in our checklist in our seven step checklist so let me do justice to this real real quick now when we talk about market structure we all know the concept of trends, right? I'm more particular about trends right now. It is either price is, is going on an uptrend or a downtrend or price is going sideways. But you only want to be trading either an uptrend or a downtrend. You want to know exactly what the market is doing. You don't want to guess what the market is doing. You want to react 
to the market. So let the market tell you that, okay, I'm in an uptrend. Then you start looking for buy opportunities. Where the market tells you that I'm in a downtrend, you start looking for sell opportunities. So uptrends are this: you have an impulse move, you have the correction, you have the impulse move, correction, impulse. Okay, this is a downtrend, right? You have impulse, correction, impulse, correction, impulse. Okay, so quickly, what are the? How do we label? an uptrend or a downtrend we are used to this um you have the higher lows here higher lows over here you have the hold on you have the higher highs okay higher highs here higher highs higher highs higher lows so this makes up an uptrend okay when you have new higher highs being formed tells you that price is in an uptrend okay so the first thing you want to do is to identify that price has printed a trend this first one is what you want to identify the market so where the market has printed an impossible correction impulse the market has told you for a fact that, okay, I'm about to go on an option because a higher high has been printed. Okay. So what you want to do in an option is to wait for a retracement. So you want to wait for a retracement and you want to buy at the higher low. Okay. You want to wait for a retracement and buy at the higher low. You don't want to sell all the way down because you don't know to the extent that this higher high is going to go, right? You want to wait for the market to retrace and form a higher low. Likewise, for, an, for a downtrend, you have the lower high here. Okay. Now, most of you know this, but we are going somewhere. You have the lower high here. You have the lower low. Okay. Lower low. Lower low, lower high. Okay. Now, for a downtrend, when you have new lower lows being printed, that is to tell you that there is continuation of the trend. For an uptrend, when you have new higher highs being printed, that tells you that there is a trend continuation. Okay. So, step one is what identify market structure. So, you want to identify a downtrend so when you see that price is a downtrend what price to have printed impulse move correction and impulse okay so once you do this once you see this that's check check one step one on the checklist is checked all right so for you to sell in a downtrend you want to wait for price to retrace and form a lower high so you want to start selling at a lower high don't buy at a lower low because you don't know if it's lower lows keep going down okay so you want to wait for a retracement and then you sell at the lower high okay now how do you know exactly the point to sell at either a higher low or a higher high okay how do you know where to sell now that leads us to step two, identify break of structure. So when we talk about break of structure, what are we talking about? Based on your trend here, now you've identified this particular trend, okay? This is the break of structure here, this here. The structural zone that was broken in this case is the higher high here. That is the break of structure zone, okay? in for a downtrend scenario the zone that was broken is lower low so this right here is the structural this this is the break of structure zone so let's leave it down real quick this is the break of so let's say bos break of structure okay likewise here uh sorry here good so this is the break of structure now 
when you are waiting for price to form a higher low on a downtrend, you want price to go deeper, okay, than the breakout structure, okay? You want price to go further than the breakout structure. You don't want to be buying here. If you are buying here, that means you are buying where every other retail trader is buying, okay? And then, as retail traders, we were taught to use break and retest, okay? So when price broke this resistance zone, you wait for it to retest here and then you buy here. But no, okay, as institutional traders, we don't buy here, okay? We want to look for a higher low below this zone because this area okay is where a lot of retail traders are going to be putting their stop losses because they are buying at this point and then they put their stop loss here but we know that the big banks before they can push the price up they need liquidity they need um sell orders and then they'll be taking retail traders orders okay so as institutional um traders we don't trade break and retest okay we wait for liquidity to be taken and then we look for entry okay so you are able to know that with the break of structure so you want to identify break of structure and then for an uptrend the higher low has to be below the break of structure okay for a downtrend, this is your break of structure. You are waiting for a retracement right above the break of structure because as retail traders, they were taught break and retest, right? So a retail trader is going to be selling here because this is resistance, okay? They'll be selling here. And then they put their stop loss above this resistance okay which is liquidity to be grabbed by big banks and institutions but as institutional traders we are trading with the big banks okay we are going to wait for liquidity to be grabbed first before we look for entry so if you are selling at lower high you are going to be selling above this structural area here so you will be looking for an entry here okay so that is um checklist one and two don't worry because this is a free video we won't really go into the basic concept but i know that this is making a lot of sense to you okay now number three on the checklist is to identify supply and demand right so supply and demand uh to um it's quite similar to support and resistance but in real sense is different okay now a supply zone is an area of the market where sellers are active a demand zone is an area of the market where buyers are active i'll take it again a supply zone is an area in the market a supply zone is an area in the market where sellers are active they perceive that this area there's a great selling potential here so they're looking to sell that particular currency a demand zone is an area of the market where buyers perceive to be a very very good buying opportunity okay and then they look for the buy at that point in time right so how do we know a demand zone and a supply zone okay now we are able to know this by the candlestick arrangement okay by candlestick arrangement so i'm going to just share with you one type of supply and demand there are two types of supply and demand okay now there's a supply called swing there's a supply called there's a swing supply and then there's a continuation pattern supply there's a swing let me write it down okay we have to start with supply and demand we have we have swing and then we have the continuation pattern okay so this is both for the supply and demand so we have a swing supply and the continuation pattern supply we have a swing demand and the continuation pattern demand okay but i'll just briefly talk about one 
in this particular training. So let's talk about swing supply and swing demand. Okay, so we are able to identify supply and demand zone based on the candlestick arrangement below a break of structure area. Okay, we are able to identify a demand and supply zone based on the candlestick arrangement below for an uptrend below the break of structure for a downtrend above the break of structure so we are looking for candlestick ar um, arrangement in this particular zone here okay so now let us know where we are to sell for this particular guy here we are looking for an arrangement of candlestick here to let us know okay where the higher low is going to end and then we look for buy opportunities right so without further ado let's go let's get into the video right i've watched so many youtube videos <laughs> all right so for for swing for swing for um for a demand for swing demand for swing demand okay we are going to be looking for a candlestick arrangement that looks like this okay so drop drop is say you want to see a cell candle okay you want to see a buy or a sell candle and then you want to see a buy okay so that is drop base rally okay so drop base rally all right for swing supply you want to look for for rally as a green candle or a buy candle rally base rally base so the base is either green or red rally base and then you want to see a drop okay so let's do that all right good so this is swing demand this is swing supply remember i said we're able to identify supply or demand so based on the candlestick arrangement below or above the break of structure area okay because that will let us know um our higher lows where we buy for an uptrend or our lower highs where we sell for a downtrend okay now so uh this is getting messy so let me do this right so we are looking so for an uptrend now this is an uptrend okay so step two is what identify break of structure so this is break of structure guys so now you are waiting for price to come down below this break of structure and then you want to buy at a higher low but how do you know where to buy how do you know the exact point where the higher low is going to stop you, you need to know a demand okay now okay so how do you know where the higher low is going to stop over here we're going to find a demand zone based on the structure okay that is what um in this case draw base run so let's look at a few examples and then we'll go uh, straight into so let's find an uptrend here let's, let's find an uptrend real quick because of time what can i see okay good so i see an uptrend here this is an uptrend okay and then we'll see this particular move here okay this move coming up impulse correction okay impulse so that's an uptrend so now to buy on this uptrend you want to wait for the retracement for price to form a higher low okay or where do you do that now an average retail trader that sees this uptrend would want to buy at this break and retest okay so they would want to buy here okay to continue but the price did that you know tricked some people into the trade but took out their stop losses 
but we are going to use this particular entry here we're going to use this demand zone here rally base job base rally okay we use this place so we are going to enter at this particular zone here so we look for entries here okay let's find an example for an uptrend for a downtrend real quick and then because of time i'm rushing okay let's find an example for a downtrend okay so we see something like this this is a downtrend right impulse correction impulse all right now Step two is what identify a breakout structure, a breakout structure over here. Okay, an average retail trader is going to want to sell at this retest, but they were tricked into entering the trade, but they, but their stop loss were taken out, and then price went in the normal direction. So you will you will wait for price to be traced further into the breakout structure, and then. You look to your left you want to find a swing supply okay in this case you see it's rally base drop candlestick arrangement rally base drop okay over here and then you can see price react so you're looking to your left to find that arrangement rally base drop green candle red candle green candle red or red red or green candle and then it drop red candle so over here, and then you can see how price reacted over here. And then you can see that move. And one thing that you learn that once you start trading this concept, your risk to reward will be very, very massive. You can risk 2% and make 20%, okay? One to five, one to six, one to 10, one to 20. We don't really do one to one here, okay? So we risk a little amount of money and then we'll make more. Okay, so once you are identified a supply or demand zone over here, for example, now the next thing you now want to do is to what go to a lower time frame, which is your step four. So for daily, you go to a lower time frame like your 30 minutes or the one hour. And then over here is where you start looking for a particular entry confirmation. Okay which has aligned carefully here but we are not going to show you this particular entry because that is information for the premium um it's a premium content okay so now very very quickly um i think i've been able to explain to you why you lose money as a retail trader and how you can start trading is institutional concept so that you can move with the money start being consistent understand the footprint of the market makers know how liquidity has, is being taken and how you can capitalize on those moves and trade with the banks okay so guys let me give you the offer right now for people that want to learn more about this particular trading concept i've i've shown you briefly three steps majorly okay but this is a seven step process the seven step process has to has to align before you take one trade so don't just go use this three-step process and then just run with it okay it might not really work for you okay there's a seven step process that you need to follow okay and it's available for in the institutional trading uh, premium content so i want to give you the offer right now because of time okay now this offer is for 100 people only and it is valid for just 72 hours now if you are aware about this um, trading concepts you know how much information like this costs but i'm not really doing this for the money of course for the money but of course i'm going to make it affordable for a lot of people to be a part of this i'm going to ensure that you go through the course content and ensure that you have access to coaching and mentorship as well so this offer is an offer that you should not refuse okay now I'll be very, very honest with you. Learning this particular trading concept might not be something you can learn on that one month and master on that one month. If you are trading institutional concept, I give it to you. You need about three to six months, okay, uh, to really understand and grasp it properly because it's quite, um, it's quite. There's a learning curve to this thing, and then I want to be with you by this um, every step of the way to ensure that you understand this stuff. Okay, so that's why. The offer 
the first offer is a three month program of the Forex Without Tears Academy. Okay, so it's a three month program where you have access, you have lifetime access. So let's talk about the features of this three month program. The first feature is that you have lifetime access to a training library on institutional trading. So you get access to a course platform where we've explained everything. Okay, so this is the course platform right here. Okay, so you get access to this platform whereby you have access to all the videos. Okay, on everything. You, you can see that just on this liquidity um, alone, I spent about 30 minutes explaining this concept. We go in depth, okay? And um, it is also available for people that are just getting started with Forex as well. You can also be a beginner. You can start from the beginner session, but if you're already trading, you can just keep to this concept and learn about everything. So you get lifetime access to this course platform, okay? And then you get three months of mentorship, okay? Now, how good will it be if, as you are going through this course right now, okay, you have access to me to ask me questions, okay? For um, you can request for private one-on-one -on -one sessions, okay? So I, I I want to ensure that you are going through this properly. I'll be there with you every step of the way to ensure that you are not making any mistake. I'm literally going to be holding you by the end to ensure that you understand exactly what is being taught. Okay. Now you get access to twice a week live analysis and Q and A session. Every Mondays and Thursdays we do weekly trainings to solidify what you learned and then we will analyze pairs together. So what I will do for you is to show you how to do real analysis how to do back testing and live testing as well. You get access to weekly trade setups and ideas. As you are learning about this particular concept, you can be earning as well because I'll be posting trade ideas and setups on the on a particular channel that you can take those trades in. Okay, so let me just take you real, real, real quick to the channel, okay? So we use a Telegram channel, guys. For this now this is the telegram okay you can see fw trade setup and then you can see access to trade ideas okay and then i give you exactly the entry point and this entry point these setups are sent way ahead before it happens it is not a market execution entry so this is a sort of that you can enter with pending orders so before it happens you can enter that trade so you have no reason not to enter this setup and then guys trust me we are very very profitable i'll show you a few examples of you know trades that we take and then how we make money all right but that's what you have access to if you have access to this trade um to the trading channel trade ideas channel and then you can take trades as we call them okay you have access to private one-on-one -on -one sessions with me as well every month we can schedule a zoom session me and you and i walk you through your questions and help you understand this concept okay get access to the trading community and support group we have a, another telegram channel where everybody is in we are asking questions we are posting chat analysis we are supporting each other okay and then lastly you have access to a raffle draw to win two thousand dollars in funding okay so um that is over one million naira that you can be trading so every um month or every two months we do a raffle draw for people in the community okay to get access to two thousand dollars in funding okay so this is money that you can start trading instantly right and even if you lose that money you are not penalized for losing the money at all okay so we are we are partnering with a particular pro firm to fund traders and then guys everything here is going for just 55,000 naira only guys this is how much i would normally chat for one month okay but for people that take action from now to the next 72 hours you get this three month program for just 55,000 naira only this is about a hundred dollars and they are getting access to this training mentorship live analysis weekly setups private one-on-one -on -one sessions a community 
and then you you send a chance to win two thousand dollars okay and then you be withdrawing the profits all to yourself okay so everything for just fifty five thousand naira for people that take action between now and the next 72 hours. Now, after the three-day period, this will go back to the normal price. You won't get it for this price again, okay? So this is the first plan that you can choose to opt for. Now, the second plan is the six-month program. Now, the six-month program gives you access to everything in the three-month program. And then, but you get access to mentorship for six months, okay? Me and you every week for six months every month for six months and then you get instant access to two thousand dollars okay if you make payment today for the six month program okay we can give you the two thousand dollars the same day but i advise that um you actually know what you are doing first before you get access to that money and then you trade it okay guys think about it do you think you can lose in the first market anymore when you have somebody that's already making money okay giving access to a platform the training and then walking you through this concept himself holding you by your hand for three to six months okay if you go through this three to six month program then and then you are still losing money then maybe there's something wrong with you to be very very honest right so this six month program is going to cost you only one fifty thousand Naira. guys this is something that i paid okay it's not up to what i paid for one month okay when i learned this concept from my mentor okay but i'm doing this for people for fast action takers if you are really serious about making money consistently in the foreign exchange markets you want to start trading institutional concepts and i'm going to give you I'm going to make it easy for you to get started. So you can get started on the three months program or on the six month program. Okay. It's for people that pay between now and the next 72 hours for hundred people only. Okay. So if you are serious, if you are, if you are an action taker, click the link below the video right now to get access to the course. Okay. So when you click the link below this video, you'll be taken to this page right here and then so over here on the right hand side where you see select plan you choose a plan you want to go for okay the first one is a three month plan the second one is a six month plan and then you click on buy now so you can make payment via bank transfer or you make payment with your atm card and then once you make payment you get instant access to the course you can start watching it immediately you also get a message from me giving you access to every other thing that we talked about okay let me just show you a few testimonies um, of some people in the community let me share my screen where is whatsapp hold on just a few people if i can remember their names uh i think i remember one afiz now afiz is is about one month plus in the program right now you can see it was you know sending me some result you can see now i already qualified for funding okay so i'm not kidding with you here okay now i is funded with 157 dollars and then in less than a month he gave his account to 365 dollars that's 100 percent profit in a month trading this same concept okay i won't dive deep into you can see is um these are his trade charts. You can see he wins more trades than and he loses. Let's check out another guy. Okay. Uh, let's check out Desmond. Desmond is also um is also new. Okay. Now Desmond, when he started, he was sending me the trades every day that he, that he was trading. Okay, so this is the sixth trade. Okay, Desmond has been making money pretty much every day and is always in profit. Okay. Someone that just got started trading forex is making money, smiling to the bank every single day. Okay, now they are they are able to get this result because they are they are putting in the work and then they are using what the 
trade setup sent on this telegram channel okay for example this card jpy trade okay let's go there before this trade happened we sent it on the group okay so i said when price gets to this um bos entry place they should take entry so people that put orders here okay would be in profit so let's go to this setup on the chart so this 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 was sent january 19th okay so let's go to kdpy january 19th chart real 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 quick on the front 10 minutes where is my screen give me a second guys okay so let's go to kjpy real quick and then see the trade that was sent on the platform kjpy yes kjpy okay so let's go to january 19th 19th of january let's rewind this 19th of january so we're right here now we're going to, to the 15 minute chart okay good so this was the entry guys this was the entry okay so i sent the trade when price was still here okay so you had a lot of time a lot of time unlike other signal platforms that they do market execution this one you had ample time even if you are working okay you can take entries that we send all right so check out what happened when price got into that zone okay immediately okay imagine you for the risk to reward if you took entry here even on this trade this small one okay one to five if you risk five percent on this trade okay you would have made 25 percent this this should this should alone would have maybe based on your capital cover the cost of you being a part of the program and then we sent many many more so many many more entries guys let's check out another um we set another setup okay euro usd there's one i want to show you uh we sent one okay gbp AUD. now this is results because when i post setup as well i like to take my trade as well these are small account that i was flipping this is a real account that i was trading okay and then for gbp aud we sent them this particular trade you can see before it happened guys before it happens i said when price gets here we sell before it happens so let's go to gbp aud real quick and then show you what we are talking about okay that's on the four hours gbp aed okay so at that point this was where it was okay good so and then this was the zone that we picked so i said when price gets somewhere here you take entry and then price did just that guys this this trade triggered on um the first day of the week and then you can see the move happened now these are the kind of moves that we catch every single week and once we're part of the mentorship program three-month program you have access to what you can trade okay every single week as you are learning okay you can also be earning so we have everything you need to become a profitable trader right on the program you get access to training mentorship and funding as well okay i don't know of a lot of mentorship programs that give you funding they do not exist right we are the first program in the world when it comes to first thing that that gives you access to funding for free okay once you are a part of the program okay so as you can see this is value value way beyond what you are paying for okay so it's for people that are action takers so take action okay either a three months program or the six months program click on the link below this video 
right now, okay, to get access. Because once we have maxed out 100 people, this will be off the table. And then only for people that take action in the next several two hours. Okay, so click the link below this video, you get access to this page, all right, and then you select the one you are going for, either the three month mentorship or the senior mentorship, and then you go ahead to make payments. You will get instant access okay to everything and then you get an email from me about how to access every other thing that we have planned out for you all right guys uh hopefully i see you inside i'd like to work with you and i'd like to make you my next success story take action guys nothing works until you put it to work cheers bye bye i love you